What is COVID-19? In 2019, the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention CDC, started monitoring the outbreak of a new coronavirus, SARS-CoV-2, which causes the respiratory illness now known as COVID-19. Authorities first identified the virus in Wuhan, China. More than 78,191 people have contracted the virus in China. Health authorities have identified many other people with COVID-19 around the world, including in the United States. On January 31, 2020, the virus passed from one person to another in the U.S. The World Health Organization WHO, have declared a public health emergency relating to COVID-19. Since then, this strain has been diagnosed in several U.S. residents. The CDC have advised that it is likely to spread to more people. COVID-19 has started causing disruption in at least 25 other countries. The first people with COVID-19 had links to an animal and seafood market. This fact suggested that animals initially transmitted the virus to humans. However, people with a more recent diagnosis had no connections with or exposure to the market, confirming that humans can pass the virus to each other. Read more about how pangolins could be the source of COVID-19. Information on the virus is scarce at present. In the past, respiratory conditions that develop from coronaviruses, such as SARS and MERS, have spread through close contacts. On February 17, 2020, the Director General of the WHO presented at a media briefing the following updates on how often the symptoms of COVID-19 are severe or fatal, using data from 44,000 people with a confirmed diagnosis. Stage of severity rough percentage of people with COVID-19 mild disease from which a person can recover more than 80% severe disease, causing breathlessness and pneumonia around 14% critical disease, including septic shock, respiratory failure, and the failure of more than one organ about 5% fatal disease 2% The director general also noted that the risk of serious complications increases with age. According to the WHO, few children get COVID-19, although they are still investigating the reasons for this. However, while some viruses are highly contagious, it is less clear how rapidly coronaviruses will spread. Symptoms of COVID-19 symptoms vary from person to person with COVID-19. It may produce few or no symptoms. However, it can also lead to severe illness and may be fatal. Common symptoms include Fever breathlessness cough it may take 2 to 14 days for a person to notice symptoms after infection. No vaccine is currently available for COVID-19. However, scientists have now replicated the virus. This could allow for early detection and treatment in people who have the virus but are not yet showing symptoms. The National Institutes of Health NIH, suggest that several groups of people have the highest risk of developing complications due to COVID-19. These groups include Young children people aged 65 years or older women who are pregnant The CDC advise that although there have been reports of complications in young children, these are rare. COVID-19 most commonly produces mild symptoms in children. Subscribe to this channel Baby Time FYI for more video thank you.